they were against him. Because he was coming and teaching them something new. And claiming that he was God and the son of God and whatnot. So, but he, but Nicodemus, he secretly flees. And uh, in John 3.1, I'll just read it from there. It says, there was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews. The same came to Jesus by night and said unto him, Rabbi, we know that thou art a teacher come from God. For no man do these miracles that thou doest except God be with him. Jesus answered and said unto him, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, except the man be born again, and I see the kingdom of God. And Jesus saith unto him, How can a man be born when he is old? Can he enter the second time into his mother's womb and be born? Jesus answered, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, except the man be born of water and of the spirit, he cannot enter the kingdom of God. That which is born of the flesh is flesh, and that which is born of the spirit is spirit. Anyway, he said, you got to be born again or else you can see the kingdom of God. Him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God, even to them that believe on his name, which were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of God. So in other words, says in Revelation 20 11 through 15 it says but it's, it says they that were not written in the book of life were cast in the lake of fire and it says it says this is the second death so to sum it up if you're born twice you only die once You only born once from a mother, born of the flesh, you're gonna die twice. What about those ones that have died already and then came back? Which ones? Like the ones that have died before and they brought them back to life. Oh. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, well, those are. Uh, what about those? Those are exceptions. rule in your heart since as members of one body you were called to peace and be thankful let the word of God dwell richly in you admonishing one another teaching one another with songs spiritual hymns gratitude in our hearts towards God whatever you do whether it's word or deed do all in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ giving thanks to God for the Father to live. check it out Against abortion, 